Let's graph the equation for the line y equals 1. So simply put, we would go to the y-axis. y is going to equal 1 right here. And then we can just put a horizontal line through it like this. Put some lines on either side. And that's our graph for y equals 1. What this means is that for any value of x, y is always going to equal 1. So if we had x is 3, y is going to be 1. If we had x is minus 6, y is going to be 1. So our y-intercept is 1, and the slope for this line, this horizontal line, is going to have a slope of 0. But let's graph some points just to show how this works. So we said that y is always going to be 1. So we can choose any value for x. How about 3x and y equals 1? If we had 1x, y would equal 1 again. And if we had negative 6x, y would equal 1. So these points here should all fall on our line here for y equals 1. Let's try it. x is 3, y is 1. Here's x is 3, and y is 1. x is 1, y is 1. x is 1, and y is 1. And finally, we have x is minus 6, and y is 1. So again, they all fall on the graph. We have a slope of 0, and we intersect the y-axis at 1. This is Dr. V with the graph for y equals 1. Thanks for watching.